One of my distinct memories from being a child is uh, my mother breaking bread two or three times a week at home. And then uh, I remember I wanted to try it and the first time I did it, it wasn't very good. And then the second time it was a little bit better, but it wasn't very good. And then I just kept trying and eventually I managed to get it to the stage she's at. And then I managed to now, with the experience I have as a cook, I can make it even better than that. And it's that progression from the start, from not knowing what you're doing to understanding it to actually making it very, very well. That's what really drives me and it's the improvement, the progression. I want to become a chef because I want to make people happy with my food and surprise them. I never really set out with an intention to be a chef, but I started washing up in a restaurant and I just became immediately hooked with the atmosphere. Because I really loved cooking when I was younger, it was really my only happy place. One of the main reasons was um, actually like my parents and my family life growing up. My mum grew up in a pub. My dad was like a big, big um, sort of lover of food, always sort of getting me to try new things and sort of cooking with me and stuff like that. So I made my way to the kitchen and sort of the rest is history really. I love cooking. I started when I was 17. I, I love this pressure. It's always been my dream since I first started cooking is to work at this level. Actually, it was not planned at all. I, um, I wanted to study before we had to start. Um, we had to do an internship in the kitchen and I just sticked around there. I fell in love with the job, with the kitchen and everything what belongs to it. My ambition for the future is to open a restaurant in Sicily uh, because the economy in Sicily is not really so good. So it's a challenge. Like literally, it's just to work up in core, work up quite a lot, work up all my way, work all the way up and be the best. Uh, my ambition to the future is um, definitely would love to open a restaurant with my wife. Um, so it's both our dreams, sort of own our own place and sort of one day do our own thing. Ideally to go to the top of the industry, like or to run and to operate a restaurant of this level. The thing that makes me very proud is actually working here at Core for Chef Claire. At the beginning of my, my journey, I never even thought I'd come to London. So to be working in a, in a restaurant like this for people like this is something I, I'm immensely proud of. So when I was seven and I had this notebook, I wrote down the name Ellie's Kitchen, uh, which is named after my mother. I want to pursue that. I want to open it up. Um, in the book it says Mayfair, I'm not quite sure if that's exactly where I'm going to be. Well, hopefully I can uh, keep travelling as I'm doing now, keep learning new languages, new skills, work in very good restaurants across the world, eventually one day make it back to Sweden and have my own place, my own family, my own house, in the countryside where I came from. I want to be the best chef in Poland. The thing that I'm most proud of for my career to date is moving to London, moving outside of uh, my comfort zone, leaving my friends, leaving my family, um, leaving my life behind to start over here. Um, London's quite a competitive city to work in and as a chef, it's quite difficult and uh, I'm proud of what I've, what I've achieved, what this restaurant's achieved and um, I would do it again and I would recommend it to my friends back home that are cooking as well to come challenge themselves like this. I'm most proud of myself in the personal, going to um, America by myself, working out there, pursuing cooking. Um, yeah, it was a big step and uh, I learned a lot and it really taught me that even in hard situations I still want to be a chef so I know that is in my blood basically. Where, when, how, I don't know but I, want, I know I want my own restaurant with my own team. I think the most proudest moment of my career was probably the day that um, the chef said that I was going to be the sous chef here. I'm proud because my like, family is very proud for me when I come to, to London and I start cooking on, on this level. So one of my most proudest and most memorable moments is definitely the royal wedding, the day we did it. It was very, very intense, very, very uh, exciting. One uh, thing I'll remember for life, definitely. I'm really proud to be a woman that is working in a kitchen. Hi, my name is Ben. Hi, my name is Christina. Hi, my name is Josh. Hi, my name is Lois. My name is George. Hi, my name is Jamea. Hi, my name is Mikai. My name is Maria. My name is Emma. My name is Jack. <laughs>